what made me post what I posted, what made me emotionally lose control. And there's only one thing that can make me do that, and that's my kids. Um, and nothing else. So, many of you know, well, I divorced Cora because we got into an argument. Whoever has custody of the kids at the moment of the divorce is filed has custody of the kids until you go before a judge. That's why I was going to get a restraining order on Cora to make sure that I have Where did you have custody? Well, I, 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 You're a in front of my kids because you regret these children. You didn't even look at that one. I held that one for the first half hour of their life. You can't do that. You can't do that. You can't call me that in front of my kids. I will call you a fucking cunt, a whore, a slut in front of my kids until they're 18 years old. Because that's what you fucking are. And Cora says things to hurt me sometimes. And she repeatedly told me that she regretted June ever being born. And... I asked her to stop saying that, and June was in my arms crying, and she repeatedly said it over and over again. I called my mother, who will testify this in court, that she would kept saying it over and over and again, and I said, you can't say this to June, she understands what you're saying, June's crying. I attempted to take June out of the room, and I said, you can't be around your daughter if you're saying this type of stuff. And she came across the room, my mom's on the phone, will testify this in court, and ripped, violently ripped June out of my hands, and, then, and very close di dislocated June's shoulder. The next, that was when I posted online that I was divorcing my wife and I can't be treated this way anymore. When I went live and said, say it again, it was that, that she regretted June being born. So fast forward, many of you reached out to me and I have talked to an attorney. I have talked to an attorney. I'm ask and I can't see my kids right now and I'm asking for public support because I love my kids. Two days ago, many of you reached out to me and asked me to go get the kids because she was being negligent when, when, there, when she was inside the sink. Um, there's a garbage disposal in that sink within reach of June's foot. So she was putting her foot in the sink and there's a garbage disposal and she could have easily mangled her foot. And then Athena's head was drooping and she was like, like getting her airway choked off and I communicated this and she ignored me I called her she hung up on me so at legal counsel I went and got my kids for the last two days to protect her because many of you were reaching out to me and saying that they were going to call child services which would not be the first time child services was called for negligence so I went and got my kids and explained to her why I was taking control of the kids. I was not withholding her, and I had no intention of keeping the kids from her. Today I had to work because we haven't found a nanny yet, and I asked her to watch the kids for a little bit, and she agreed. And I said, I will be taking the kids back to my, my house. And when I got there, her friends, handed me a pile of papers and the police were there. Well, they showed up later. 
she falsely filed. So I can't see my kids for, it, it looks like a month because because she's trying to hurt me. I love my kids and my life. And um, now I'm taking full custody. I'm going to fight her. But my mother will testify in court that she physically assaulted my daughter because she was on the phone. So I'm asking you, and I have all the evidence I need to get full custody of these kids. She says something untrue against me, and I, can, I will slander. I will sue her for slander, but everything I'm saying, she didn't retaliate because she doesn't want people to know these facts, people to know these facts. And I wouldn't have said these facts, but you hold my kids from me, and I will, because my kids are my life. I, I, I keep hearing married is not a bed of roses. I agree. Every relationship takes time, patience, courage, and communication. I didn't have that. I had, I'm not going to play it because that can get me in trouble, but I have audio recording of her saying trouble, but I have audio recording of her saying this. I'm not working anything out of 